another beautiful day here in South Florida. This morning, the weather was absolutely gorgeous for this flight to Marathon. I was really excited for this flight today. We were headed to Marathon to meet up with some other pilots that had left yesterday. We had met up for lunch and then we saw them off. We were actually the last ones to leave, but they are there waiting on us. I can't. November 57 Victor, contact Miami Approach on 125.5. But today, I'm flying with Trey and Yasmin, and we are all pretty excited about this trip today. Since we were all pretty excited to get to Marathon, we decided to take the shortcut, which is flying out west, west of Miami International, and across the Everglades, direct to Marathon. Everybody was having a good time, including Yasmin, who was very relaxed for flying in a small airplane for the first time. The ride was so smooth as we climbed up to 4,500 feet, and the airplane was perfectly trimmed. We hardly had to touch the yoke. It was like we were flying with an autopilot, and it kept us smooth in the climb. This was awesome. Now, uh, we're approximately 15 miles. We already called in to the CTAP to let them know we're here. As you can see on the horizon, it's right there. Marathon. Marathon traffic, 857 Victor, turning final. Uh, 07, Marathon traffic. Marathon traffic, uh, 8957 Victor, short final for 07. Marathon traffic, there he is, the numbers of the downward. As we approached Marathon, we heard how busy it was, but I was able to sequence myself and get myself in line to land quickly. There's nothing like being celebrated for a beautiful landing. Marathon traffic, uh, 57 Victor is off the active runway. Alright, 57 Victor, we made it. We're in the marathon. So we're here with the team. We had some numbers from the 99s meet up with us. Yeah. We were special invited guests from an all-female aviation group called the 99s, and it was so nice that they picked us up from the airport. Aquarium Encounters was our first stop. We had to kill some time because we were actually late, so we stopped here to look around and burn some time to wait for the other members of the 99s who were at another venue. It was really cool here. Saw some nice stuff. Alright, on to the next location. Alright, so we are here at the Dolphin Research Center. This is where the rest of the 99s were finishing up their tour here at this facility. Hello. After meeting up with the other members of the 99s, we headed back to the Airbnb where there was food and drinks. My favorite. We had a blast hanging out and it was nice meeting all of these amazing pilots. Another venue. Another After the party was over at the Airbnb, we had one more stop to make before heading to the airport and flying home. We stopped to the Turtle Hospital, and this place was very interesting. <laughs> The tour started 
started out with an orientation where we had to sit and learn about the turtles and some of the things we could do versus what we couldn't do. It was nice to see how they ran this facility. It was all really interesting. I learned a lot about the turtles that I never knew before. Here at the turtle hospital with all of the pilots. There we are. The tour was outside and we couldn't help but to notice this. The weather was creeping in. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Rain. And before you knew it, we all had to run inside from the rain, cutting our tour short, but we didn't mind. But we immediately went into pilot mode. The dot is where we are. I don't want to glare. Okay. okay, the dot is where we are. As you can see, that stuff is coming. After it passes, we can go directly north and back up to Miami, which is fine right now. We got a little bunch of them scattered out, out over there, but it's fine, we can get around. So everybody's running in because they got caught in the rain. Yeah. And this is what you do. You sit and you wait the weather out. You don't try to be Superman, superhero. And that's what we did. We all got comfortable and relaxed and prepared to wait the weather out. So we are done with the animal hospital and we are headed back to the airport. All right, we made it back to the airport. Definitely here at uh, Marathon. 5-7 Victor still sitting there. Most of the weather had moved out. Even though there was still a light drizzle, it was still okay for us to take off. So we're here, yeah. By the time we were all out on the runway and taking off, the rain had stopped. We were the first to take off and the other airplanes were behind us. Trey would do the flying and I would handle the radios. We were sharing the flying duties. Marathon traffic, uh, Cessna 8957 Victor, last call. We are clearing uh, the traffic area northeast of Marathon traffic. The skies didn't look all that friendly, but the ride was amazingly smooth and the view was actually beautiful. We chose 3,500 feet as our cruising altitude. And this had us above the clouds. It was really beautiful. And the ride was amazingly smooth. And we were having a good time. Best part was we knew that where we were headed, the weather was great. Like we had expected, the weather started to clear up and we could soon see blue skies. We indeed had an amazing time. It was an amazing day. I really enjoyed hanging out with these guys. So much fun. <laughs>